good morning everybody whoa 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 hello everybody <laughs> it is morning but uh we are still camping we are leaving today but i figured i'd bring you guys along um my kids love these vlogs they love seeing the adventures we go on so today we're not just like getting up and going well okay i don't know what time it is it's only 10 30. so the plan is to kind of pick up around here get it to where we could easily get going um, but we're gonna go explore the granite tours campground a little bit more but we're just gonna go walk around look around yesterday was so fun if you haven't seen that vlog go check it out because we went on this like crazy hike and it was <laughs> intense i am not feeling it yet but i know i know I'm gonna be very sore once that kicks in because that is a hike. <laughs> this morning, we just kind of spent outside drinking coffee. I got little cereal boxes for the kids, like the, just the old school tiny little boxes of cereal. There was like a really good deal on them. It's these little guys. I didn't plan on them having them this trip out, but they were really excited to have them. So um, they had that for breakfast this morning. A little bit ago, they were saying they were hungry for sandwiches. So I just made some sandwiches. I'm gonna get dressed, then we're gonna go explore a little bit more before we head out. Moose poop, don't touch it! <laughs> Snow has gotten smaller since we've been here. It's almost gone. helicopter's about to land here, which is so cool. So we're gonna hang out way, 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 way far away and watch it land. Plug your ears, plug your ears. <laughs> that's so cool. What an adventure we have had. Addie just told me that it looks like those trees are hugging and that might be the cutest thing you're gonna see all day. <laughs> are they hugging? Tree hugging? Okay, so that was pretty cool that we just saw a helicopter land in the middle of Alaska, in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> pretty cool. Who remembers last year when we came out here, we were looking at the sign and looking at all these and we went hiking for like two miles that way and never saw that sign. Trail that way. We're not doing the trail today because we're quite exhausted from yesterday still, but they want to go out on the bridge.
hello everybody so I forgot to end this video out as well so I figured I'd kind of not only um, end this one out but also kind of give you an explanation of what's going on I'm very behind on videos obviously um, my kids are filling pools and getting slip and slides out so there's noise all around sorry not sorry <laughs> but um, we got home and we were like all the kids were so exhausted for days after that hike especially Landon like his he was exhausted so um, we got home and got all the things taken out of the camper and Lance had to work the next day So we had to get him ready for that. So that night uh, I was kind of decompressing because it's a lot getting home from camping and emptying out the camper and all that and I heard a crazy boom on our house. I immediately was like, oh my gosh, like a bed fell over the bunk bed fell over Lance fell out of bed. I didn't know what it was. It was like brain rattling loud and so I like rush upstairs I see that Lance is in bed and he's all confused he's like what's going on like why are you running in here um so I like I didn't even tell him what was going on I just like ran in the kids rooms the first the boys room because they have a bunk bed and I was like the only thing loud enough to make that sound is gotta be the bunk bed falling over and the boys were just totally fine run in the girls room they're totally fine I was like okay I can calm down now I went back and I was like, Lance, uh, just heard the craziest sound. It literally, it, it sounded like a truck hitting our house at like 60 miles an hour. I knew there was no way it was nothing. And so I come outside and sure enough, we had a tree fall on our house. And I'm gonna post the picture right here. It doesn't look like a very big tree, but our house is very large. And the loud sound I think that we that I heard was the tree came down and then it cracked and then it hit the house again on the second level. And when I tell you it was the craziest sound, it does not look very bad, it looks like a tiny little tree. It's a very large tree. So um, our two-story house makes it look much smaller than it really was. Anyways, our house is fine and I am so grateful for that. Lance was able to safely get it off the house. We are very big on safety. Lance has always been a safety conscious person and so we were, weren't were sure if we were going to be able to get it down um, but no, he was very careful. Um, just took a chainsaw up there and took tiny little chunks off at a time. Anyways, it was quite a dramatic day coming home. Normally I would have like ended the vlog and I was so rattled after that I think I was up to like 1 a.m. because I was just so shooken up like the sound was awful I was just so glad all my kids were okay and and Lance <laughs> Anyways, um, so those videos I filmed, um, this is like the day before you're gonna see this video, but those videos were filmed about a month ago and I'm so sorry I'm behind, but I have been filming all of our adventures. We've had a lot of stuff going on, doctor's appointments, and um, we had a lot of family come in for my grandma's celebration of life. I didn't vlog anything except for our adventures. Um, we also, the next trip you're gonna see is we went to Birch Lake and we spent five nights out there and it was so fun. It was the hottest week of the summer, though this week is giving a, giving it a run for its money because we've been like 75, 80 these last two days. And so, whew, as you know, we have no AC, okay? Also humid. My watch is saying it's 75 degrees now with 40% humidity. I do think it's about to rain right now, but it's been humid all day and it's just, hot man I don't know how you people do it like in Florida when we went there on our honeymoon I was like ew <laughs> we can't handle that it, we used to be very dry here um and it does cause a lot of fires but anyways okay I'm gonna end this one I'm gonna keep punching out videos I have a trip for a family wedding here soon so I'm really excited but I do have a lot of videos coming at you guys and again I'm sorry they're so behind but um, my priorities are family friends all of that and the summer has been absolutely phenomenal so anyways hit that like hit that subscribe and we will see you in the next video bye